Hi, my name is Amit. I'm an osteopath. I'm the creator of OsteoFlex, a series of deep muscular stretches with the aim to improve your circulation, improve your posture, and beat the stiffness. In today's session, we're going to be focusing on your shoulders, your shoulder blades and upper back, and also your neck muscles. This will help you if you are sitting at your desk all day, if you're either slumping in your couch all day watching TV, or if you're a laptop or a phone person. Okay, we're going to start off by sitting today to focus on our upper back and our shoulder blades. I want you to find your most comfortable sitting position. If it's cross-legged, then absolutely great. If you can't sit cross-legged, try and sit as easily as possible with your legs folded, or if you can't do that, with your legs open in front of you, okay? For the benefit of the video, I will be crossing my legs. More comfortable for myself. So, for the shoulder blades, we are going to interlock the fingers in front of you. Try and keep your elbows as nice and straight as possible. We do need to go at the angle of the shoulder blades when we are doing the stretch, so watch my posture carefully, okay? So first of all, we're going to take that whole deep breath in, all the way into the stomach, first of all. When you take that breath out, that's when you're going to drop the head, you're going to drop your arms to the angle of the shoulder blades, and then pull as far forward as you can and you should begin to feel the pull all the way through, okay? So, interlock the fingers in front of you, and take a deep breath in. After five, we're gonna breathe out, drop the neck, and then pull the arms away from us. Five, four, three, two, one, and breathe out. Remember, look at the angle of my arms. This is the angle to pull apart the shoulder blades. Also, see what I'm doing with my upper back. I am rounding myself. When I take this next deep breath in, watch what my shoulders are doing. Watch what my upper back is doing. And take a deep breath in. I'm forcing all the air to my upper back, the top part of my lungs, rather than my stomach or the chest. Hold that breath. Stretching, keep pulling those arms away from you. You'll really begin to build the stretch through the arms. And five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Good. You should begin to feel a deep loosening of your shoulders. Okay? We're going to do a slight variation to that shoulder blade stretch. We're going to try and force each individual shoulder blade this time. So we're going to interlock the fingers, you're going to pull it forward on the out breath, you're going to take that all the way towards the opposite side, so towards the knee, and then all the way away from you. This time we're going to be focusing on an individual shoulder blade. So take a deep breath in. After five, you're going to breathe out, and you're going to take your arms to the left. Five, four, three, two, one, and breathe out arms all the way to your left hand side, drop your head down, force the arms away from you, and remember, you want to feel the stretch through that right shoulder blade, all the way through the right torso, and keep pulling your arm away from you. Feel the stretch through the shoulder blade, and take a huge deep breath in to your upper back. Keep feeling that stretch, keep pulling your arm away from you, keep holding. And five, four, three, two, one, and breathe out, and shake yourself off. Good, and we're gonna do the same stretch towards the opposite side, okay? Interlock the fingers in front of you, drop your head down, and take a deep breath in. After five, you're gonna to go to the right. Five, four, three, two, one. Breathe out. And head down, arms away from you. Feel the stretch at the shoulders, the upper back. And take a deep breath in. Force your arms away from you. Feel the stretch in the upper back. Shoulder blades, arms, keep holding that stretch, force the arms away from you, and five, four, 
three, two, one, and relax. And shake yourself off. Okay, we're gonna move on to a couple of neck stretches. We're gonna take our left hand and place it on the opposite side of our head. I want to slowly bring the neck all the way down as far as you can. You'll begin to feel a stretch through a group of muscles called your scalene muscles. They're probably very tight and you'll begin to feel that stretch. I want you to take your right hand onto the floor to enhance this stretch even more. Try and walk those fingers away from you and you will begin to feel a greater stretch through the side of your neck. Just hold that stretch and just keep pulling as much as you can. And remember, when you take this next deep breath in, take it towards your upper spine, your upper chest, and take a deep breath in. Again, this will greatly enhance that stretch. You will be feeling that deep stretch all the way through the neck, but this will be great for you at the end. Just keep holding that stretch. Hold that breath. Remember, let all the muscles go as well. Don't keep yourself tight. And five, four, three, two, one. And relax. Good, and we're gonna go for the opposite side. So take your right hand all the way towards the left hand side of your head and pull all the way down. Place this left hand on the floor. Walk the fingers away from you as much as you can. You will feel the added stretch to your neck. And take a deep breath in. Again, this breath will enhance that stretch, making it that much more uncomfortable. It's absolutely fine. Keep stretching. Keep feeling that stretch, that pull, the tension. Remember, relax the muscles as much as you can. You just help those muscles elongate. Get rid of getting rid of that stiffness. Five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Slowly bring it back up. Your neck is a very fragile place, okay? So whenever you do any stretches with the neck, it's always nice and slow. Now we're gonna move on to some posterior muscles of the neck, okay? So when we do that, this time you're gonna be looking in the direction of your knee or your other knee, okay? So, we're going to start off with the left hand side and look towards the left knee. Take your left hand, place it at the back of your head this time and just drop your neck forward. You'll begin to feel a stretch all the way through the posterior neck muscles. This is a very good stretch for anybody suffering with neck pain, neck stiffness, headaches, tension, migraines. Really help just loosen things off. Remember, relax the neck as much as you can. Let yourself go deeper into the stretch. Remember, it will be painful. Just allow yourself to go kind of sink into the stretch. Five, four, three, two, one, and slowly bring that head back up. Remember, do everything nice and slow when it comes to the neck. And I'm gonna do the same with the right hand side. So look all the way down towards your right knee this time. Take your right hand behind the head and slowly take your head all the way down. Relax the muscles. Feeling that stretch. Hold that there. And five, four, three, two, one. And relax. For the best results, begin and end your day with these osteoflex stretches. Always consult a professional if you are suffering in pain. And thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time.